Hi guys, what is up? It's JanfunxHQ here. <clears throat> I'm bringing you another video. This is a 35 and 8. Uh, get a swarm on drone, that's it. Uh, and this is proof that I actually have the diamond SMGs. I'm not sure if I've. Oh no, yeah, I have uploaded a diamond SMG one before. It was the PDW. Um, but this probably is my favourite SMG on this game at the moment because they're bringing out that Peacekeeper, um, the DLC. So, what I'll do uh, on the 29th, I might bring out some map breakdowns, like where all the hard points are on the maps. Uh, so then, if you're a hard point player and you watch this, and you watch that video, you get a head start uh, for everyone in, in front of everyone else, and you'll know where all the hard points are. I'll get that as soon as the map pack comes out, probably. If I do get the map pack, um, and if you want some zombie gameplay on Dare, um, Die Rise, um, just post in the comments, and I'll bring out. A live commentary. I'll try and figure out how to do a live commentary. Put a face cam in, <coughs> and see what round I can get to very first try. Um, and maybe I'll bring a peacekeeper review if you guys want that as well. Just leave in the comments. Uh, so let's talk about this gameplay. Um, I it was 35 and 8 on drone, and the funny thing is, um, I get my swarm, and then I'm like literally right at the end someone on the enemy team gets a swarm and uh, yeah it's just kind of funny because yeah it's just weird um, <clears throat> I do quite well in this game I do alright I guess but today I went I just hopped onto ground war very first game and um, I done really really well in the first round I got about 49 to four or something and I was doing so well and I thought yes this is going to be my hundred plus but sadly all the bad people left and a lot of good people joined and I ended up going 59 and something so I, I've recorded the first round and it's only like a two minute video two and a half minutes so if you want a commentary of some kind over that then just leave in the comments one that which is short enough to talk about so yeah, um, let's just get into drone. Uh, the B flag is really hard to secure on this. Well, if you don't know where to go, really, you can hold, uh, hide behind the truck. You can hide behind the barrel back there. Depends really what what side they're um, spawning. And with this A flag, I love spawn trapping me. I love going into this building, just sitting in the window and getting kill defender kills while they're running up the stairs and. Uh, really good spot and then you just peek your head out here see if there's anyone there and then wait and then well I think I capture A I'm not sure oh no then I flank round and then I capture A I think <laughs> so yeah um so I don't know why but I really didn't like the scorpion at first it had way too much recoil but I've grown to like it now it's so good I don't know how I didn't see that guy but I still get him <laughs> um it's just you need to get used to the gun really it's a really really good gun when you, once you get used to it um, I recommend using fast mags and suppressor on every single submachine gun it's just a really really good setup and then using scavenger toughness ghost hardline or flak jacket and hardline because I started to use flak jacket on my mp7 class now because I'm starting to use the mp7 quite a lot and uh, you'll see that um, gameplay which I was talking about which is really really good in the first half and I get a swarm within about a minute or something I, I do really really well but sad the second round wasn't good um so yeah um I'm seeing as, seeing as it's double XP weekend I might get a hundred plus on Nuketown 2025 but the thing is uh, it may have a lot of deaths added to it, so I'm not sure what I should do. Uh, just leave in the comments if you want to see 100 plus. If I've had about 50 deaths or something, I don't know, but or more. Um, 
But it's double XP weekend now, guys, if you didn't know, so I would hop on and try and prestige, because I'm 8th for now, like 33, and I'm trying to get to 9th this whole weekend. And I'm starting to do game battles now, but I'm not really sure how to do them. Um, I think you just find a match and then accept it, and then you have to read all the rules, but... I created a game battles account ages ago, ages and ages ago for my, well, I'm not sure if it was ages ago, I think it was last year or two years ago, but I thought it was ages ago, when I had my Playstation, um, yeah, when I had my Playstation, I used to fucking die hard on that all the time, um, and then I went to the horse races and uh, bet on a couple of lucky horses, won 50 quid off two and then 70. So I had enough to buy an Xbox, which was like 170, I think. And I got the new slim one, 250 gig. But uh, if you guys want any Nuketown zombies, because I got the hardened edition of this, uh, of Black Ops 2, if you want any Nuketown zombies, uh, just leave in the comments because I, f I think Nick Sound Zombies is quite good and m me and my mate got to about round 40 when he came right over to my house and we were just so good because we only just realised that we were on the LAN or whatever so it didn't count on the leaderboards and we were pissed. <laughs> it took us about 3 hours, 3 to 4 hours, well about three, 2 3 hours to get to that round and we were, we were pretty annoyed. Um, and uh, I've had a bit more use out of these control freaks now, I've used them a bit more, got to grips with them, I know I mentioned them in my last video, um, but I've used them quite a lot now and they are really good, so I'm not being paid by them obviously, because I've yeah, barely got any subscribers, and uh, I think they're a really good product, and I recommend the Astro A40 gaming headset as well, um, it's just really really good for recording videos because all you need to do is just unplug the USB from the um, Xbox and then just plug it into your uh, PC or laptop whatever you're using and you're sorted literally so if you guys want to know a cheap ish um, editing software which isn't like 300 quid for Sony Vegas or something come it's called Corel, spelled C-O-R-E-L, Video Studio Pro X5, that's what I use, and it's it's a really, really good uh, editing software if you guys want to um, wanna get that, if you're starting off on YouTube or something, I don't know, but it's really good, and uh, if you want any attachment guides as well, or weapon reviews, just leave in the comments, I know this sounds like... I'm stuck for ideas, but I'm really not. I just have. I could do a weapon. Just leave in the comments what weapons you think I should compare or review. I'm not sure. Whatever you want. Um, or a knife only swarm. I almost got one the other day on Kill Confirmed because I was trying to get that humiliation title. I just need stick, uh, stick medals and backfire medals. And. Uh, yeah, I think I think they're really difficult to get, um, but I'm not really trying to get them at the moment because if you want to see, well, I I'll probably put out just this little clip of uh, me getting a cross map tomahawk on. What what's that map called? Um, Carrier, that's it. Because we just got on C and I loved the tomahawk, and while he was running away from me, I got him, and that's how I got the long shot with the combat axe. So how to get a long shot of the combat axe, I recommend just as soon as you cap the objective just lob to near the enemy objective and you might get lucky like I did. Um, and uh, yeah so in this, well with drone I recommend going around the outskirts and not going straight down the middle because that's literally just suicide. Um, and right here they get their swarm and I never knew that there was an opening up in the building and I got killed by the swarm um, and then he gets a load star at the end as well which is pretty gutting um, if you want to see me use different score streaks as well leave in the comments just whatever if you want to do this gameplay is coming to an end now so rate 
comment, subscribe for more or Black Ops 2, whatever. Uh, so yeah, see ya.